Welcome to Events and Maps. In today's tutorial, we'll guide you through the process of creating an attribute schema, an essential feature for organizing and managing your data within the app. An attribute schema allows you to customize the data you collect for each feature in your maps. Whether you're mapping tree species, land parcels, or any other data, creating a schema helps you keep your work consistent and organized. You can create an attribute schema for an individual feature or for an entire layer, and it's often best to apply it to a layer for consistency across your data. Let's start with how to create an attribute schema for a layer in Events and Maps on iOS. First, tap the menu icon beside the layer you want to add attributes to, then select Edit. Scroll down to the bottom and tap on Add a new attribute. This will bring up the Edit Attribute dialog. Rename your attribute as needed, such as tree type. Then choose the type of data for this attribute, for example, selecting string for text values. If desired, you can set a pick list for your attribute. This is helpful when collecting predefined values. For example, for tree type, we might add options like oak, pine, cedar, and maple. When you're done, tap the back arrow to save your attribute. Repeat these steps to add additional attributes as needed. Here's an example. For a tree inventory, you might collect tree type as a string cut as a boolean, circumference as a real number, and lot number as an integer. While it's possible to create an attribute schema outside of Events and Maps using software like Notepad++, it's recommended to create it directly in the app. Events and Maps uses the KML format for attribute schemas, and creating them outside the app can sometimes lead to formatting issues. With your custom attribute schema in place, Collecting and managing data on your maps becomes more efficient. Whether you're a professional surveyor, a forester, or an outdoor enthusiast, Avenza Maps gives you the tools to stay organized. Thank you for watching. Subscribe to our channel for more tutorials, tips, and tricks to get the most out of Avenza Maps.